Well, Allison, a deadly mobile home fire in Salisaw was under investigation, and 4029's Brett Rains talked to police, firefighters, and family members about what happened. He's live there now tonight with what we know so far. Well, family members did not want to talk on camera. They tell me Charles Tinsley only lived here on South Main Street in Salisaw for a few months when the fire happened. Now tonight, police and state fire marshals are investigating his death. They say right now there are no obvious signs of foul play. Family members say Charles Tinsley lived here with his son and another person. They say he loved animals. But on Sunday afternoon, Salisaw firefighters were called to the mobile home. It's only a few blocks away from the fire department, and firefighters were here within minutes of getting the call. But the fire chief says they could not save the 57-year-old man. The chief says firefighters found Tinsley not far from the front door. His dog also died. Tinsley was the only person home when the fire happened. Right now, firefighters are not sure how the fire started or if there were any smoke detectors due to all the damage inside. And investigators and family members are now waiting on reports from the medical examiner's office to determine exactly how Tinsley died. Live in Salisaw, Brett Rains, 4029 News.